un message pour le monde. Euh, pardonnez, mais n'oubliez jamais. genocide I was seven years old. My father was Tutsi, my mother was Hutu. Uh, we were nine children. When the genocide started we escaped from home to our grand our grandmother of my mother because they were Hutu. So in that time we said they would help us to survive. I were with my two young brother. I took them there and then we when we reached there uh, found other brothers, but they, they, they died after. And then when we were find somewhere to, to, to hide, at that time my mother took my two young brother to be killed. The one who killed my two young brother was our cousin. So, and then after, when I came back, also I saw my mother came, and then she took me also me to be killed. It was very difficult. I was crying, and then we go to also my my uncle. My mother asked him. I brought him to be killed. I don't want him anymore. I was uh, in the house of my uncle. I listened the noise of people. Then I say, Oh my God! They come to kill me. Then I take a decision, I ran the way out uh, at the back of a house in a small, uh, small cheme, a small road, then I found the Mukurarinda dead bodies. Then because they fight each, they fight themselves, then they killed themselves. And I say, oh, now that one who, who wanted to kill me, now he's dead. It's better to run away, maybe I will die another day. As a kid, I said, oh, maybe I'm going to tell my mother. We, we went there to the Mukurari. Oh, she cried. Instead of crying of her sons, her children, then he cried of, his, uh, of her, her, her brother. And then I say, oh, if my, ma if my mother is crying, it's time to, to run away. After genocide, uh, you see the police, the government of Rwanda decide to provide the punishment of the people who participate in a genocide. So I went to the police, then I tell them exactly what happened, what my, my mother and my cousin and my uncles did. So in that time they say, you see, your mother participate in a genocide, so he must go, she must go in a prison, she must go punishment. But it was not my wish. She was the only one I had in that time. No brother, no father, no one. So I take my, I take my two young brother and myself. Um, the mother is the is a, is a only one important in my life and to everybody's life. Did. You see, when my mother went back to her family, so they said, you see, you did wrong, you did a mistake, you married with the Tutsi's husband. 
we, we, now we, we, we cannot accept it because it's your fault. So better to eliminate them and then you will marry again with the, the Hutu husband. I forgive her and I forgive those people who killed my family. Most of them are my, my cousins, my uncles, my neighbor. So I just forgive her in order to make me happy, in order to make me free.